up as I say and definitely ready to go say hello to my helpers Melanie and Martina actually they'd rather have it that I'm their helper and they're probably right we need some real helpers though they're the contestants bring them on <laughs> what a fine set of contestants I mean I haven't seen such a good-looking set all day does that include me no you're not a contestant yeah, well, I'm pretty honor yeah <laughs> Yeah, from Calais. Right, who have you got? <laughs> this is Hannah and Robert from Winchester, and they both attend the Henry Beaufort School. Yeah! How do you do? Are you OK? Yep. Marvellous. Yeah, nice to see Robs. And who you got, Mel? I have Rhiannon and Curtis, and they're from Cardiff, and they attend the Glendora High School. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> Curtis, you might have had a bit of a trim on your old barnet before you came along. <laughs> Look at that. Far too long for this show. <laughs> He'll be washing his hair every two minutes when he gets gungy. Good luck to all our contestants in the fun house today! Yeah! Now, here's how it works for you guys. I'll explain to you, because just in case you don't know, and also for those of you at home as well, we have three fun-filled games on the way, each one worth 25 points. The winning team bring you back here, hit those lights, 25 more points, correct answer, simple as that. One of the games is a key game as well, so there could be points for the runners-up. Then the Fine Cart Grand Prix, then a trip inside, uh, where should we go? Uh, that one. Oh, that fun house? That fun house. Will you use that one? That one? That's yeah. our favourite one. That's the one we're going to use. Power Price. Excellent today, so stick around for that. Mm -hmm. Going to be absolutely marvellous. Take the girls away, get them ready. First game. Oh, boys, you just wait here with me. You're going to love this. You're going to love it because you're not in it. And it is kind of messy. So the girls are going to get messy first. It's lucky that they're young girls because they are about to be minors. Minors with a difference. As we play Vest Quest. <laughs> Heidi, hi, you lovely miners. How are you? Have a look at my coal, and you will see that we are deep down in the mines and preparing ourselves to find various different vests. This is simply the vest game you're going to see today. <laughs> okay. Uh, they're laughing, they're smiling, smiling children. I love it. Okay, your job, your mission, should you decide to accept it, and you've got to because you come this far, is to basically go in your little mining carriage here, up and down, up and down. Watch out for the, for the guns. You won't be hunks of coal or anything nasty like that, but it will be funhouse gunge that could fall down upon you as you grab a vest, because obviously your vests are getting very dirty, so you need to put on a nice clean one each time. Uh, will it be clean with the gunge on it? We don't know. But get as many vests as you can inside 60 seconds, and you'll be the winner. Right, you go on up that end and prepare yourself for a good kickoff, and I'll prepare myself to run out of the way. Uh, by the way, if you don't do well, you will be under a vest. On your marks, get set, go! <laughs> a massive round of applause. They did very well there. Very well indeed. Very well. Messy game for starters. I like that. Starters, you mean to go on? Yeah. Come on in, Reds. Right, we got one, two, oh, where's that one? Three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah! And over on the 
the yellow side. Hello. We got... <laughs> Hello. <laughs> we got one, two, three, four, five, six, <gasps> six, seven, eight! Oh. Yeah! Bad luck, you Reds. It's yellow points. Let's rerun that coal mine fun. Yeah. So Hannah just nudged Rhiannon there and got 25 points for the yellows. Yeah. So bounces out. We're all going hooray, yippee. Hooray. Boys question. Are you ready, boys? Good luck, chaps. Get set. 25 points for this, and you don't even have to get messy, which is uh, much nicer in my book. What kind of old-fashioned train uses coal as a fuel? Steam train. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, well done. You have to think about it, but he got it there in the end. Zero reds, 50 yellows in the lead. Now, would you take the boys away, because it's about time they got a little bit wet. Yeah. Girls, you can stay and watch this and enjoy yourselves, because we're going to be the, uh, the viewers of the Fruit Fun Day at the Fun House Pool. Oh, yes, we are. They're going to be collecting lots and lots of fruit. Uh, because it's in the pool, though, I guess it won't be dried fruit. Come and have a look with me! Yeah. All right, Fruit Fun Day, and I found myself a very nice little banana split. Let me just... Uh, mm. Mm. Right, I have to tuck into this while the boys are playing the game. However, as you can see, the boys aren't actually boys. They're more sort of Carmen Miranda types. They look like fools. <laughs> fruit fools on our Fruit Fun Day game. Your job, guys. Jump in, up the corresponding <laughs> rope, yellow or red, grabbing the yellow or red fruit, i.e. the bananas or the strawberries, one by one, back down into the seashells. The one with the most fruit in the seashells at the end is the winner. It couldn't be easier. This couldn't be tastier. On your marks, get set, go! No! Amazing at the end there. A pull up and a little flick. Yeah, we're going to give that one to him. That was fantastic. That was a really dramatic ending there. Well done. Brilliant. Okay, yellows first. How many bananas? Okay, we got four. Yeah. All right, Reds, I can't reach you up the far end, but I'll trust you. We got, oh God, three. Yeah. Yellow points. Let's rerun the fruit fun. A top banana game for the yellow team. The man from Del Funhouse, he said yes, 25 points. <laughs> Ready, girls, here's your question. Stand by to hit those lights. As long as you've got the right answer, that is. Don't hit it unless you know the right answer. Which fruit featured along with the character James in a popular book by Roald Dahl? Giant <laughs> yes. Peach. Giant Peach, yes. a bit for me. Well done. Just what the Reds needed, 25 points. So now, 25 plays 75, the yellows are in the lead. Yeah! All right, Robert, it's your turn for a bit of interrogation here. You've been to casualty, haven't you? Yeah. Tell us about that. Well, when I was younger, I was jumping on my friend's bed to bed to bed, and then I jumped into the wall and I got a scar on my forehead, and then I had to go to casualty. Yeah, I can see that scar. It's still there, isn't it? Yeah. So the wall sort of just jumped out in front of you. It wasn't your yeah, fault. Yeah, no. <laughs> Got out of bed the wrong side, and there it was. All right. Well, uh, I think you'll be OK in our last game, because it's perfectly painless. Unless, of course, you're worried about the dentist. So please, take them all away and get them prepared. Because um, according to the Funhouse rules, 
We are about to uh, do some serious drilling at the dentist. Ah! And here we are, or should I say, um, here we are. <laughs> Well, all right, I can't really say that because you don't understand a word I'm saying. In other words, you understand a word I'm saying. Pull the other one, Pat. That's what we're going to be doing here, as the boys are the patients. You will need a lot of patients to be there, OK? Because you cannot move, you're going to get very gungy. Over here, we have the antiseptic, which our nurses will be placing their hands in for a little wash, I think, each time. Yeah, it's just like, ugh. Yuck. Hideous. Some of that to the crowd. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Then they'll grab one of these rather fine uh, bibs, and they'll take this bib, and they go around here, and dive over the giant swab. You know what the swab is? The sort of thing they put in your mouth at the dentist when you're, when you're being um, operated on at any time. Uh, it sort of sits in the corner like this, and uh, make sure the dentist can get to your teeth. You know what I'm talking about. So you dive over there, but of course you'll be going this way, you'll be going that way, crisscross, so you have a bit of a mess. Get over to this side, place the bib on your man, and then give this a good pull like that. Wham! And that is the mouthwash. However, of course, um, it's up to you whether you keep your mouth open or not. If I were you, I'd keep your mouth shut and your goggles on. Let's see how we get on in the key game today. Runners-up will receive points. Uh, I'm gobsmacked, personally. On your marks, get set. Whoa! No, no! The screams! The screams! <laughs> now, over here on the red side, we're going to count up the successful bibs. Right, we got one, two, three! Yeah! Of course, the one at the very bottom isn't counted yes. because that was on at the start. That's why. So if you're okay, at home thinking, now it's four. The, sorry, that's the one that was on the start, Good. so that don't count. So we've got one, two, three, four! Oh. Yeah! Well done, Yellows, unless you're cheating, in which case, pull the other one. Hey, let's rerun the fun! Get away! <laughs> well, chaps, the good news is uh, your teeth are fine, but I'm afraid your gums will have to come out. But uh, that's the way it goes. Uh, nice antiseptic mouthwash, good key game as well. And don't get down in the mouth, Reg. You've still got three points for the key game, so it takes you to 28. But the Yellows, you floss ahead with another 25! <laughs> you out. The yellows have 100, the reds have 53, so the yellows are ahead. <laughs> They're ahead of the reds, so what are you going to do to catch up then, Curtis? You got any plans? Win the Grand Prix. Win the Grand Prix. Well, good luck to you, good luck in the Grand Prix, good luck to all of you. I know the girls are about to bring on the cart, so let's do it! <laughs> All set by the looks of things, fantastic. And you guys have got your helmets done up. Have you got all sorted out, all safe, yeah? Good, brilliant, brilliant. So uh, the rules you need are very, very simple here, Curtis and co. All you'll be doing is having three laps of the Grand Prix. And hopefully in those three laps, you'll be getting some plungers on the way around first time, the tens. On the way around the second time, the 25s. On the way around the third time, nothing. Checkered flag, go for it. That's the deal, who's going first? Mm. Mm -hmm. We'll try again, ready? Only rehearsal. Who's going first? Me! Um. Ah! Humans! Let's do it! Excellent. Right. Now, you guys are going to be really quiet for me, aren't you? Yeah. No, you're not! You're going to make a noise! Yeah. And you're going to wave your flags! Yeah. Watch the lights! This is delight! Five, four, three, two, one, go!
red racing and a very well-deserved win, including a lapping. 25 points to the Reds, catch it up. Yeah! Well done, Rhiannon and Curtis, just what you needed now. Let's see how Hannah and Robert got on with this as we hit the light and prepare to see how many little bulbs light up. What did they get? <laughs> They did very oh. well. Very well indeed. We just missing out on one at the top there. Uh, 130 for the Grand Prix, adding to their 100. 230, your score for the yellows. Yes! Very good. <laughs> now, have you managed to catch up? Here's the reds from Cardiff. <laughs> you missed 125. Oh. Your total score, 193. You're going into the fun house. <laughs> But you're not losers. Nobody loses on this show. Look at this. You got a cassette, radio, CD, nice. funhouse, styley. He's never closed when I do that. There you go. Take that. Enjoy it. There's one out there for each of you in a box. And also, welcome to your funhouse outfit. You will get a hat. You'll get a jacket. And we'll keep Mel because we need her to take part okay. in the next bit of the show. Thanks for playing, guys. Bye bye. Ah! Well, are you pleased? Yeah. Excited? Yeah. Want to know what's in the funhouse? Yes. Yeah. In that case. Gary King will tell us while you guys come on down! Yeah! Wash and run. Nick the novelty hairdryer bobbing in the ball run. Stomp down the slip and slide and make off with this mini stamper set. A tennis racket's an ace of a prize if you win on the wild slide. Which mystery prize might be meddling in the monster maze? Can you walk and talk at the same time? These wacky walkie talkies are dangling in the danger net. No mess, no hassle with the digital doggy. A virtual pet is barking in the balloon tunnel. Bob down the bob sleigh to fetch the video tokens. It's good to talk on this nifty novelty phone cradled in the crawl tube. Flee down the fireman's pole and get fixed up with these trendy shoes. This will get you up in the morning. An alien alarm clock to freak you out in the flying fox. Nicely filed in the net ladder, this musically themed trendy stationery. Play fair with the snake in the box and he might give up this snazzy sports bag. Pop over to the A-frame and pick up a popcorn maker. Go crazy and gone crazy and bounce off with a basketball set. And jump up the giant steps to plug into your own personal stereo. So Robin and Hannah from Hampshire, what do you fancy inside that funhouse? Everything. Yeah. <laughs> oh, they're not fussy then, just the whole lot. OK, well, uh, there are 15 tags. One of them is a special one because it does relate to the power prize. This week, you're going to love it. Gary? Why wait to see the results of that awesome photo shoot? Print your own pics with this jazzy digital camera and printer. Now, the big question is, where is that special tag? Just for you at home, reveal all. You're searching, aren't you? Yes. That will do you no good at all. <laughs> nope, it's just for those at home. I'm afraid you guys won't know until you grab a tag that makes this sound. <laughs> and even then, you probably won't even hear that sound because you'll be so busy running through the funhouse with your little telescopic sights there showing us the route you're travelling on. Those cameras are mobile and we'll show our viewers at home exactly the route you are taking. OK, so who's going to be going first? I am. Are you sure? Yep. That means you'll probably get a couple of runs, I would think, OK, Hannah, because you're grabbing three tags, coming back, high-fiving with Robert, swapping over and so on and so forth. Now, occasionally, you get two runs each, which could mean you're up to about 11 or 12 tags, which will be really good, which means that your chances are obviously higher of grabbing the actual tag that is the power prize related one. So we will see how you get on. I wish you luck. You've got two minutes between you. Feet on the step and on your marks. Big smile at that camera. They're watching you. This camera's watching that camera back. That camera. We've got too many cameras. Let's go! <laughs>
unbelievable. All sorts of things going on there. And you did almost start, didn't you? Almost started your second run. Come on down, Rob. Did very well. This is what you've got. Come on in, Hannah. I know you're out of breath. You don't have to do anything now. Well, you might have to do something. Let's see. You got a mystery prize, which became the Burger Bash. Yay! That's real good. <laughs> the video tokens, well done. Yay! The basketball set, yes. Yay! The tennis, what a racket. Yay! A very personal stereo each. Yay! Sports bag. Yay! Trendy shoes. Yay! Novelty phone. Yay! And hidden in that slide was the power prize. Come on! Yay! Well, you've seen this a million times on the telly, and now it's you. It must be more nerve-wracking than watching it at home, am I right? Yeah. Ten seconds, think about it. You've already got all those prices on the floor, one each, OK? Now it's your turn to think about this answer inside of ten seconds, and maybe you'll get the digital camera and printer each, OK? You ready? Yeah. Please confer. Ten seconds is quite a while. Don't just blurt it out. I can only accept your first answer. Here we go. And you at home, if you know, be quiet. Don't shout it out. No help. There are five interlinked circles in the Olympic symbol. Tell me three of the colours used. Black, red, white, blue, 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 blue. Blue, black, and red. Yes! <laughs> I cannot believe it! And you got them. All right. Thank heavens for that. Congratulations, you've got it! The digital camera each, the printer, everything on the floor, and you've been on the biggest game show on CITV. We'll see you soon on Funhouse! Yeah!